Uber has been banned in London for not being a fit and proper business. Translation, skyrocketing rapes are going unreported. According to Transport for London, Uber's license will not be renewed beyond September 30th, with the first reason listed being the company's approach to reporting serious criminal offenses. This includes Uber's failure to report rising numbers of rapes and sexual assaults by its own drivers. Latest police figures show that Uber drivers are now responsible for one sex attack in London every week, with sexual assaults by Uber drivers skyrocketing by 50% in just a single year. Paul Joseph Watson draws a connection to the fact that many Uber drivers are now newly arrived migrants or refugees, many of them from Muslim backgrounds where drunk and scantily clad women are seen as easy prey and quite often deserving it for being out late at night by themselves. Uber drivers are not required to go through the extensive training and background checks that your typical cab drivers have to go through. This is exactly what happened in Austin, Texas a couple years ago when Uber was banned because the company refused to force its drivers to go through fingerprint background checks. This is something that the taxi cabs have to do in Austin, but Uber, they made it seem as if this was government intrusion into private businesses, when in actuality, going for those fingerprint uh, background checks would have cost them a lot of money. It would have been too expensive to do business in, in Austin, Texas. This was the argument that they made. So basically saying that the cost of doing business trumps public safety. And this is now what we're seeing happening in London. So according to a letter written by Inspector Neil Balani, the head of the Metropolitan's Police, Taxi, and Private Hire Unit, Uber has been made aware of criminal activity and yet haven't informed the police. In one case, Uber continued to employ a driver known to have committed a sexual assault before that same man went on to attack another woman. Ubers are also not required to have CCTV cameras in the back of their taxis like the black cab taxis in London are required to do. So this puts even more women traveling alone at risk of sexual assault. Now, of course, Uber users have showed their frustration immediately. They're panicking saying, whatever will I do now that my beloved Uber is not around? How can I get around without this app? Of course, there are many other means of transportation, all of which existed before Uber even came along. Now, London Mayor Sadiq Khan says that users should direct their anger at Uber for refusing to follow the rules and make public safety a top priority. In ancient times, man roamed the earth in a constant state of hunting or being hunted. Introducing Caveman, where cutting edge science meets ancient super nutrients. Secure your bottle right now at InfoWarsStore.com.